It is now September of the Galactic Year 2244. We've integrated the Oracle into our government's protocols, a move designed to boost Chancellor Yingdan's efficiency at running our empire. We have two new colonies. We also may have finally encountered an alien species with an empire similar to ours, and we know no fear. Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and this is episode 12 of my YouTube campaign in Stellaris is Humanitas. Uh, what's new? Nothing's new. We, we had some protests last episode, but that all worked out fine. And we're losing some energy credits, but not many. I do want to take a chance to say that I'm, I'm really doing well sticking to a Monday, Wednesday, Friday release schedule. I haven't decided on a good time, so if you know a good time that you'd like to see an episode go live, um, let me know in the comments because I will accommodate. You know, I've tried to time it around people's, when people might have a lunch break or might be getting out of work or going home. And speaking of timing, I should set my alarm to make sure that I don't uh, go too long here. And I'm going to be like a week ahead. This is going to be nice. Just have to upload the episodes, which does suck. Anyway, let's time pass. Construction complete. Technology discovered. All right. Anomaly detected. Archaeology is going to be good. New research shields. Ooh. Better point defense or better shields? I say better shields. I. Thought tile modes are nice. Shields. I am concerned that we're not going to have enough. Reactor power. We're going to pick up more visual aliens is the, of the res aliens. It's inevitable they will leak to the wider public. Their appearance has proved delightful. Xenophiles. Okay, they are a hostile. Go away. They are hostile rocks. Okay, well, hostile rocks it is, it's all good. I'm okay with that. I think all of humanity is. This would be a great system to colonize, if I'm being honest. close to done with the system, are we? Not close. Kianki are moving around. So we can't inhabit the tomb world. Uh, it, we're this big. The galaxy is this big. Like, it's a big galaxy, no joke. Pila, might, I might need to build a space station here. Star Base Limited 6. Evading hostile. What are you doing? Why? Not this one. This one just. Concrete, yes. Build Star Base. Go, do it. Uh. Countering bids, we made first contact with aliens known as the Samek aliens. We're almost at end, boys. Getting this system colonized will be tremendous. Uh, we can pick a tradition for a building slot or resettlement costs reduce. Well, building slot would help Earth. Let me build another building in Earth. Mm -hmm. 
clerk jobs. Sure, clerk jobs. Will they crank that trade value? Get in the friendly UFOs? Oh, well, we've met some, like, space whales. Pilot Prime has unemployment. We're still having generator problems. Construction complete. We should offset that a bit. Res aliens have paid off. We finally discovered their language. We've successfully opened diplomatic channels with the Bodranite Commonwealth. Our presence in the galaxy has not gone by unnoticed. You're speaking to the Bodranite Commonwealth. The Chancellor is our elected representative, and truth all citizens have a voice in our government. We strive to better ourselves through technology. A desire we do not expect from aliens such as yourself to understand. Hey, we're happy. The news we have intel encountered intelligent alien life for the first time is spreading like wildfire throughout the humanitas. Our citizens are fascinated by these beings. The media is full of reports and speculation on their culture and society. The revelation that we are not alone in this galaxy has largely been greeted with celebration on Earth. Just like us, the aliens appear to be relative newcomers to the galactic stage and their level of technology is similar to our own. Cool. Where are they? We are building the star base. We are not yet done with it. Zorf. Zorf is good. Sirius has another building slot. You know what I haven't built a lot of? These. Sirius Prime is an industrial world. Lacking the minerals. Uh, we have established communication with the Independent Space Station of the Association of Upside. Our presence in the galaxy has not gone by unnoticed. Say, so, yeah, I'd recognize these kill features anywhere. Some fine work. We make a habit of keeping up with what's flying in the galaxy, try to keep up with friends. Trends, but where was I? How can we facilitate your interesting? Yeah, that's a new mechanic. I'm I'm not familiar with that. Upgrading the starport will take 200 days. Turn into a hostile void cloud here. How about here? Construction complete. Uh, Construction you? complete. You will also become a starbase. Ours and troop is nice. I might be able to do something like that, but I can do trade. I'm guessing these are their borders. Archaeological site. It was strangely difficult to locate the archive on Aurelia 3, but once we did locate it, it was easy to see why it had been so elusive. The crystal has been shattered and contains no records we can access. However, a faint signal suggests there might be something else to find here. As in society, it's this is a much smaller sign of crystal has been located in some kind of laboratory. The Zeroni recorded their findings, were extremely frustrated. Their research had been ridiculed by their peers and was largely discredited. They believed the Zeroni were no longer the only entities in the Shroud and that the collective fears and desires of their entire race were coalescing to distinct sapient entities. Desiring to grow stronger, these entities had begun to subtly influence the emotions and thoughts of the suitable Zeroni, slowly causing their behaviors to become more extreme, may have caused a civil war. Okay, so what you're saying is there's a new archaeological site. How come we can't live on a savannah? 
pretty continental. Where are you? You're in core. Okay, well, get archaeology. And research the anomaly for the fun of it. That should help our generation. Boom. Economy salvaged. Freaking planet. Well, it's a breadbasket. Interesting. So, who's this? This system is just going to generate food for me. Build mining stations, build research stations. Construction complete. Anomaly detected. Leave the anomaly be. I feel like exploring the rim would be fun. But exploring the interior is probably the only way we're ever going to connect our land or at least know what's between like our southern point and our northern point. Technology so, discovered. Oof, tough one. Atmosphere filtering, habitability 5%. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Fleet command limit would be nice because it lets me merge my fleets into two. Uh, I might have to do that. But a planetary capital sounds more important. Tecram for a strategic research is zero. We're not going to need that. Hold up. Petrogo can get an upgraded thing. Anomaly detected. Leave stuff B. Uh, we're gonna get a trade hub. bring us in a lot of trade actually and then we're gonna get what else are we gonna build I mean I could build anything I want to build Anchorage naval capacity four or shipyard build more ships Anchorage probably should connect yeah yeah, we can connect. Yeah, I've, I've talked before about how my cursor bounces, and, and that's because I bounce. Anomaly you can see detected. me bouncing. My wife points that out all the time. I think I heard her come home. She'd probably laugh her head off. Construction complete. These things we can actually take on. Survey complete. Research complete. Semi solid materials. Cool, cool. Better guns, better hit hold points. Hold points might be the right way to go. Construction complete. Uh. Fish system requires some expedition across the galaxy with two purposes unknown. Okay, cool. I forgot to advance that. Tomb World with a gateway!
thinking. We go here. That way we block in these worlds with these alien vessels that we can actually take on. We can take these things down. These would be continental worlds, size 15, and the desert world, size 10. Zeroni Major Colony, unlike the previous Zeroni Worlds, Kortu is a, clearly a major colony with several cities of varying size covering the surface. However, like the others announced, it's empty, showing no signs of disaster or death. The fate of its population is unknown, so the archive has been detected, and will need to be investigated. Sweet, so we gain some research. Uh, Caravaneers! They're commercial advertisements. They call themselves the New Mystic Order and are part of a spacefaring trader on screen. What the f Show us your wares. I give them alloys, they give me relics. I know it's still early game, but I'll take it. It is tempting to take a gateway system because long term I'm going to need that. I'm going to buy more alloys. Move here when you're done building stuff. Construction complete. Anomaly detected. I don't care about Construction anomalies. complete. Good on them. We're gonna go interior. It's definitely one of the largest starts I've ever gotten. First contact with the lagging shoes vestige. Little creature has never been ruined the stars for eons for your hapless species master space flight. If any of your wretched little ships cross into our space, do not expect them to return. Survey complete. Where? Ugh. Fallen Empire. Let's declare war. Great fucking plan. Quick way to die. System are you again? Why did I build you? Trade. Trade hub gives me trade from this, trade from this, and potentially more trade as time goes on. Evading hostiles. Okay. Can I get there from here? Oh, 
I hope I didn't just teleport my science ship magically. That would be cool. Yeah, I didn't think so. So I guess we're not going anomaly detected. This direction. I'm not interested in messing with the Fallen Empire anytime soon. They are problematic at best. Let's go a little extra long on this one just for the fun of it. So, I can upgrade to Starhold. Have alloys. Destroyer, destroyer, and Corvette. Anomaly detected. It's Friday, I'll go a little longer. Watch me get lost. Construction like 20 minutes complete. Later, like, oh yeah, I'm doing a thing. Taking so long. Just gotta get there. Ooh, that's a cool sound effect. Well, let's listen to that one more time. That's fun. Most of the accessible records focus on the course of the war. Our working theory is that the movement of the population increases the strength of the record about our subject, meaning the most thought about issues are reported. Detected. Shut up. With greater prominence, and surprisingly, the course of the war was on everyone's mind. The majority of the Zeroni side of the saviors, while they had an advantage in numbers, they bore one significant disadvantage. Heedless of their effects in the galaxy, the divine were free to use their full psionic might. Meanwhile, the saviors were limited to whatever power could be drawn from their own bodies. All at first, the war seemed hopeless, but eventually, here along with the saviors, make a terrible yet vital discovery. Escape discovery. Research lab. I'm actually really good on generators. Well, the research lab here too. Zorf will need hollow theaters. There they are. That's it. That's all we can build. If I do recall correctly, I, I went for a more populated galaxy, so we have uncovered a new archaeological site. A shipyard? That's weird. My closest shipyard is Earth, huh? the science ship and explore the eastern rim did i meet vegeta yet um no i didn't put the saiyans in this game i could have i thought about it i thought real hard about it but i didn't do it but i am wearing a dragon ball shirt i know that says dragon ball z let's see if i can get it close so isn't that funny? So, I guess the question is, now that I've done a week's worth of episodes with 
the camera on. How does it look? How does it work? Do you, do you like it? Does it make more sense? Um, those are the questions that will baffle humanity for the rest of time because I need to build more star bases. I paused. Technology discovered. Technology shields, cool beans. Fusion reactor, it's time, it's time. Uh, let's go to... Technology ship discovered. Survey complete. I'm betting that shields are one too many energy. We would like to extend our deal. Black track can fit new shields. Ruma Carla right now? Why do you, what are you? P-Rock. Uh, reactor booster, yes, it's safe. Are you not using, you're not using the thing, okay. Uh, kill auto upgrade, give me the reactor booster, give me the shields. I can't do that yet. Uh, shield, shield, shield. Let's upgrade, upgrade. Technology discovered. Society is not being researched. Storage capacity would be nice, but unnecessary. Fleet Academy. That's pretty neat. I don't know what an edict's fund does. That's for the wiki. I gotta ask the wiki. Tile blocker. Let's go with you. Engineering, I swear I would have. I'm not doing L gates anytime soon. City district housing, I'm not really worried about that. You can build robotic assault armies, that's pretty cool. You can build droid workers. Gas extraction wells. Even though the AI is really... Camera's fine, Trigger says. Well, I'm glad to hear that. I mean... Gas extraction wells or droid workers. It's time to start. What are you doing? Do this. It's time to start unlocking other stuff. Do have to wrap this episode up soon. Survey complete. Survey, survey, survey. Ships upgraded. Starbase ships, ships are upgraded. upgraded. Can I build a ship designer now? Save yes. Let's do the upgrade dance one more time. Let's recruit an admiral. Station five it Ships is. Ships upgraded. I hate you.
Construction complete. They're just gonna keep blackmailing us for a while. It's okay. It's all right. Establishing colony. All right, establishing colony. Survey complete. This could be a huge pocket for us. All I'm gonna say, I just I have to deal with these things, which I don't want to deal with. All right, well, I'm gonna wrap this up. Uh, we are gonna do one more thing before I forget. Bump you. Planetary capital will be nice. Let me see if I can see what the upgrade is. Extra building slot, that's interesting. That'll be good. All right, so this is where we're at. I do want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you, yeah, wars, no. No, Trigger. We could start wars. We'll die if we start wars. Plus, we are egalitarian, xenophile, and materialist. So we're really not in the war-making business. But that could change over time. My whole goal is to have some kind of civil strife with the new mechanics and the new patches. I don't know if they all work. I don't know how they all work. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like, share, subscribe, friend, follow, or whatever buttons. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can keep making more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the very bottom of my heart. I'm on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, Discord. I have a Discord. It's where I post weekly announcements of what's going on. Uh, and other conversation starters and other stuff. Uh, so check out the Discord. Link is in the description down below. Um, Brigandine on Veracity Trigger's channel. Uh, Friday nights around 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Hopefully Raging Paul is there. I haven't mentioned him. Raging Paul is awesome. He rages. It's kind of a thing. And that's really about it. So thank you all so much for joining me. If I play a little bit of this campaign in between episodes, it's just to you know, find something new to have happen. Because right now we're just kind of growing, and that's fun and all, but I feel like it's not exciting. I don't know. It's complicated. Anyway, as always on this channel, pieces. <laughs>